to get a little bit wet out there if you're in downtown Memphis. So you saw a very stray shower just pop up over the city right now, but most of us are dry. And with that, it's been a hot day. We got up to 94 degrees at the Memphis International Airport earlier on this afternoon. So above average for this time of the year. Let's take a look at the radar, though. A couple showers and downpours. You can see one over in Crockett County, uh, of course, over Shelby County, downtown Memphis. In the last uh, 20 minutes or so, this has uh, started to pop up here. So if you are outside, just give it about 20, 30 minutes and uh, this should be out of the way. We're expecting for most of us to stay dry going forward. Let's take a look at that ABC 24 Weather Watchers photo of the day. Chase sending in this gorgeous photo of that sunshine peeking out between some of those clouds that we've been seeing this afternoon. As you go into tomorrow, it looks like another hot day on the way. Looks like around a level three on the heat risk scale here. So heat should impact everyone that is outside uh, tomorrow. And it does look like things get a little bit better as we head into to Monday. So we're close to 97 tomorrow afternoon, about 10 degrees cooler going into Monday with some showers and storms. So let's talk about what's going on tomorrow morning. A very mild start, if not warm, as we are right in the middle of the upper 70s, right around 7 a.m. 82 around 8 o'clock in the morning. We're already seeing at 85 right around 9 o'clock. Plenty of sunshine. So walking through what we can expect, I think very similar to what we saw today, just a little bit warmer. So temperatures will rise pretty quickly as you get towards midday, already in the low 90s, and we're working towards the upper 90s in the afternoon. We're gonna feel like we're in the low 100s for many of us, but below that heat advisory criteria. And once again, we can't rule out a stray shower or downpour in the afternoon. I'm not expecting anything widespread, so we've kept it out of the forecast right now, but just keep in mind that we could see a brief shower here and there in those peak heating hours in the afternoon. So if you are heading out to the pool, looks to be another hot day UV index right around a 10, uh, which means you're going to definitely want to use that sunscreen middle to upper 90s with mostly sunny skies as you go through the rest of your Sunday. Now let's take a look at dew points. This shows us moisture. Here's the high pressure that's in place right now. We're going to see that moisture start to increase towards the beginning of next week, and that means a chance of some thunderstorms Monday and into Tuesday especially. We'll be watching towards the end of the week, maybe at some tropical moisture trying to cross Florida here. We'll see how that impacts your weekend though as we get a little bit further out into the forecast. But one thing for sure, that heat is going nowhere over the next couple of days and that seven day forecast shows it around 87 on Monday afternoon storms, 86 on Tuesday, but we're back to the low to mid 90s to close out the week. All right on the